Hey all, my name is Paul Borowski and I am the owner of Quality Business Plan. And what I'd like to do today is to introduce you all to my beginner's guide to financial analysis for Apple 2023. So the way the video is going to play out is first and foremost going to go ahead and give you all a little bit of background about me, who I am, what I do and why I do it. And then after that, we'll dive into some snippets of what's included in my beginner's guide to financial analysis for Apple. All right, without further ado, let's go ahead and dive into this little presentation. As promised, a little bit about me. Again, Paul Borowski, doctoral candidate, also MBA. I have been publishing company financial reports since about 2018. Typically on an annual basis, I'll do between 20 to 30 beginner's guides as well as company reports on various companies, public companies, anywhere between from Ford to Tesla to CVS and other large corporations. If you are interested in purchasing one of my a financial report or beginners guys just go to this link right here i am also an author i've published beginner's guide to understanding financial statements and financial ratios you can find that on amazon and the link is right here and then finally i am an adjunct professor and subject matter expert in finance i've been teaching at the college level for about 10 plus years now so if you are interested in some finance tutoring you're struggling with your finance class need a little bit of assistance i do offer finance tutoring my um, space is limited though if you are interested in some finance tutoring then just contact me at this email right here all right with that said let's go ahead and finish going through this report And enough about me. Let's go ahead and talk about the star of the show, which is my beginner's guide to a financial analysis for Apple 2023. In my beginner's guide, I start, uh, I break it into three segments, and it's going to be your income statement segment, your balance sheet segment, and then your financial ratio segment. And for the income statement segment, I started off with a summarized version of Apple's 10Ks for the last five years, showing revenues all the way down to net profits. And then the next part is going to be is for each line item, for the most part, I'm going to go ahead and explain what that line item is. I'll define it. I'll give it to you in layman's terms, and I'll give you some finance, um, some analysis tips as to how you should proceed in analyzing that specific line item. Next, what I'll do is for the second section is it's going to be for the balance sheet. And again, I give you a uh, summarized version of Apple's balance sheet for the last five years, which I retrieved from Apple's 10K. Again, I, I did summarize it. After that, I'll again, I'll identify the um, important line items. I'll explain to you what the line item is. I'll give it to you in the line item in layman's terms. And also, I'll give you analysis tips for each line item. For the third segment that's going to be for the financial ratios and i've i calculate y'all for y'all i'll calculate the financial ratios for um for liquidity ratios asset ratios debt ratios and profitability ratios so i broke broke the financials um ratio section i break into four different segments and for each segment i'll go ahead and i'll introduce to y'all the uh, ratios that i anal um that i include and for example, it will be current ratio, cash ratio. I'll give you the formulas and then I'll give you the findings for each one of the ratios, summarized current ratio for Apple for the last five years, cash ratio and quick ratio. And then finally, what I'll do for the beginner's guide is I'll explain to you the important ratios. For example, the current ratio, again, I'll give you the formula. I'll give it to the for, I'll explain to you what the current ratio is in layman's terms. I'll give you some analysis tips, and then I will also give you the current ratio. I'll show you the numbers that I used, the formula that I used um, to calculate the current ratio, and then I'll show you all the current ratio trend for the last five years as well. All right, hopefully this information was helpful, so let's go ahead and wrap it up and sum it up. In summary, if you are interested in purchasing my beginner's guide or financial report, all you have to do is go to this link right here. And then if you do buy my beginner's guide or financial report in the purchase, it does include a PDF file. 
And also, just keep in mind, though, it does not include the Excel financial model. That is proprietary. I do include the calculations in the financial reports, but the actual Excel financial model is not included. And then finally, if you are interested in finance tutoring, I may have space available. Um, it is limited. You, you can find out if I am available and other information by, con by sending me an email. And my email link is right here. All right, so hopefully this video was helpful. As always, uh, go out and have a fantastic day. Thank you.